Oh my fucking god! Time for a new vlog. How the fuck are we doing today, guys? I'm doing awesome and sexy. Thanks for always asking. <laughs> today we'll be vlogging about some not so good shit. Mainly because the shit we'll be talking about today, oh, it's very smelly and not so good. Firstly, yesterday I uploaded a new, um, kind of like a, it's, it's an old style video of mine that I really haven't fucking made in a long ass time, and I probably most likely will be making more of them. It's basically a story time video on my main channel. If you don't know what a story time video is, it's basically an IRL adventure where we go into the IRL of the world besides the RuneScape world and we basically do some in interesting crapola. That is on my fucking main channel, as basically I can fucking see right here, yep. Yeah. Um, annotations for some reason yesterday was not working at fucking all. Uh, was really, really pissing me off, let alone, you know, um, YouTube is a, is a broken fucking website, uh, it just really is, um, YouTube has added a new sub box layout, kind of, which, uh, well, it, it kind of affects everybody's video views, which means every person who makes RuneScape videos is going to lose, or every person making videos out there are going to be losing views, because... YouTube keeps changing the layout, and naturally, when you change the layout, it makes peop some people just not want to watch fucking videos in general. Kind of really does suck, but that's kind of YouTube fucking its own ass. <laughs> it's very funny, but it's really whatever. You can't really do anything about it because they're stubborn assholes. Um, otherwise, some other interesting shit on the bung board is BCC Dungeonary EXP has not changed. Last night, really didn't get on RuneScape too much besides uploading some shit. Uploaded a new Minecraft video on my gaming channel. Uh, been uploading, been actually playing Minecraft for actually um, a little bit now. Eh, get, getting back into the Minecraft mumbo jumbo and shit. And it's, it's always fun and stuff. Um, but otherwise, yeah, that's uh, basically pretty much about it for updates in general. Uh, tonight, like I said, we're, uh, we'll be doing some more, uh, dungeoneering. Uh, I'm not really sure if I want to do occults or smalls. I may just knock out some smalls, or I might just do some occults. Uh, kind of really feel, uh, well, I gotta really see how my balls feel. If my balls are telling me to do occults, then we will do occults. But otherwise, uh, there will be a new runescaping video and a new bungus video later this evening as well. Alright, so today we're probably going to be talking about the most, well, not really the, well, yeah, it's probably the most important thing um, that is going to be happening to RuneScape. I just logged on RuneScape, or rather, you know, whenever I get on the computer, I always go to the RuneScape homepage and see any interesting shit is happening. And, um, I basically see... Up in the uh, latest news, Evolution of Combat launches the 20th of November, 17 hours ago. <laughs> that is in 13 days, my friend. Ironically, fucking 13 and unlucky. Well, yeah, fucking 13 more days. 13 days until EOC comes out. 13 days until a lot of people really, really get pissed off. Um, now, here's the thing. A lot of people are really saying Evolution of Combat is really going to make killing shit slower. Um, I'm not really 100% sure about it. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely going to fuck a lot of shit up for Dungeoneering. It's definitely going to make shit just a lot more aggravating in general. But as for making it, I'm I, I really not sure if it is going to make it slower or not. Um, I was actually on EOC uh, this past weekend, and I was actually killing some fucking animals, and so, you know, some cows, some chickens. Really, but then again, I really haven't experimented with the, evolu the, the beta and stuff, because I really, you know, I mean, I want to play as much of the regular RuneScape as humanly possible. Now, there are a lot of people out there that actually want EOC to basically happen. That's wonderful. Just go to a different fucking world. I'm all for EOC being installed into this game. I just don't want it to be all of RuneScape. It can be separate worlds and stuff. Put the combat beta as, like, actual worlds and, like, fucking, like... Like, make it like an like all, you know, like, kind of like PvP worlds. 
You go into a PvP world, you can kill anyone wherever. So kind of make like evolution and combat kind of like PvP worlds, separate worlds and shit like that. That would actually be somewhat interesting. That would actually make the game probably a little bit more popular. Because then, if you don't want to do evolution, you know, if you don't want the new combat system, you can go back to regular RuneScape. But then again, it's really just whatever. It's going to happen no matter what. You can't really stop it because Jagex has already spent probably a lot of fucking money on designing the shit. Not to mention there's supposedly two new skills that will be coming out 2013. Uh, we'll basically vlog about th that shit some other time. But uh, yeah, it's, um, it's going to be a doozy. So Evolution of Combat 20th of November. I, I don't... <laughs> I don't even know when fucking Thanksgiving is. I, I can't... Ah, uh, fuck. Is it the 23rd or the 20th? It's, it's around that week and stuff. But, um... So, yeah. 20th of November is... Unfortunately... Wow, surprisingly, it's a Tuesday. So, I mean, like I pretty much said, major updates on this game always happens on a Tuesday. Or... Yeah, it's, it's just about... The, the HP system happened on a Tuesday. Um... The fucking, the staking and the trade limit going away happened on a Tuesday. So the major events on this game always happens on a Tuesday. How many people do I think will quit this game? Probably not. I mean, seriously, it's going to piss off more people than probably make them quit. But just from all the fucking hatred that I see against, you know, Jagex, whether it's in the comments, whether it's just a a anywhere along RuneScape videos about the EOC... It's kind of funny because it seems like a lot of people want to quit, but they may not end up quitting in general. I'll be perfectly honest. I'm not going to quit just because I kind of like the fucking the game and stuff. Um, and with that being said, you know, I, I like the fucking game, so I don't want to quit the game. <laughs> there, there's really there's no reason for me to really quit and shit. Um, however... If, uh, if it does make Dungeoneering extremely slower, which it, 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 you know, a lot of people are really saying, oh, yeah, it's going to make Dungeoneering extremely fucking slower, it's, it's, you know, it's going to make combat leveling in general really slow, then that's definitely going to be a problem. Not to mention my little Bungus character is going to have some problems, but, uh, then again, it's really whatever. Oh, well... Fuck my balls. Moving along now. Alright guys, but like I said, I'll basically be on RuneScape uh, for probably a while tonight. Don't really have too much... Oh yes, and it's actually fucking snowing outside right now. <laughs> oh god, it just keeps getting worse. And I, I fucking... I prefer the cold over the, the heat. But at the same time, I hate the cold. I mean, it, it sucks for running, it sucks for doing whatever, and then again, the, the blazing hot heat sucks as well. You can, you can never fucking win. It's either too hot or too cold. It's, it's never in the middle. It's maybe in the middle for like, probably like 30 days out of the entire year. But um, otherwise, yeah, I'll be on RuneScape. Going to be doing some Dungeoneering floors, like I said, not sure which. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much about it. But right now, I go to my email address. We have some happy hooba hooba questions from you motherfuckers. Ask nevertheless.com. I have to bring you who's because if you do, well, you'll get buried with snow. And then when you make a little snowman called Jack Frost, he will come to life and he will kill you. Kind of like in the movie Jack Frost. Ooh, that's actually a pretty good movie to watch. <laughs> ah, I guess I know what movie I'm watching on Netflix tonight. First, hooba hooba question. Do Hello, Mighty Bunghole. I was wondering if you still listen to music as often as you used to because you're getting older, question mark. Am I not getting older? You know, is it, are you asking that question? <laughs> um, I'm a bit curious. All right, your name? Uh, Smugbug. All right. Mr. Bug. This question, it's, it's very interesting because I don't think it matters how fucking old you are. You're going to listen to me if if you if you love music as much if you listen to music all the fucking time, then you're going to continue to my, my fucking grandparents listen to 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 music. It it age is not a factor for the music industry. Like the fucking yes. Now 
the record companies do appeal a lot more to the younger, you know, generation and st or the younger, the age group, the, you know, the younger fucking age group and shit. But, all, you know, people in their 20s, people in their 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, they, they all listen to music. I listen to probably more music than I did probably like 10 years ago and shit. Um, so to answer your question, I probably most likely listen to music more than I did when I was like in my teenager ages and shit. So, uh, yeah, hope that answered your question, Mr. Buggy. <laughs> Bug. <laughs> ah, but, um, yeah, so, um, otherwise, guys, if you got anything for me, you can leave me a nasty, dirty little comments. See you happy motherfuckers in a few, and bye!